Here's a tutorial for those of you who use Endomondo on your smartphones to track your rides. And um, so I'm going to go ahead and show you how to export your ride in the GPX file format using the Endomondo website. Um, so I'm, I'm logged into Endomondo. This is my account. I'm going to uh, select training. And it's going to take me to a new screen. Last time I used Endomondo was in May. As you get a nice calendar here, um, go ahead and select the ride that you want to export. Scroll down, shows you your stats on the ride, a little map of your of your trail, and above the map you have these three buttons, and you want to pull down more options and select export. Now you get this pop-up and you want to select export to GPX file. Okay, you can close that out and now the GPX file of your ride is on your computer. I'm going to go to my finder, to my downloads folder, which is where they always go, and I'm going to rename it. Um, that was May 30th, that was Leonardo, and that was that Landau. So I have renamed it and I'm going to put that in my GPS tracks folder. You don't have to do that, it just helps me keep everything sorted out. Okay, now I'm going to go to Open Trail. The Open Trail website is open and I'm logged in. I'm going to select my name, go to my profile, select the horse that was ridden on that particular ride so that he gets his miles. I'm going to select upload trail. Then your pop-up comes up to add a new trail. Select a GPX file and now I'm going to go find that which is in my GPX tracks folder. There's my ride because I have it sorted by the date with the most current files at the top of the of the, uh, the screen here. So I've got my, my GPX file selected. I'm going to click open. And then I'm going to fill out the information on this screen, whatever is appropriate. And then I'm going to click upload trail and I'm all done. If you have any questions or need any assistance, let me know.